All right, that's super cool. Super excited about the apps that are secure. Kumo is super, super cool. Um, I'm also really, really excited about Lakehouse Federation because it really enables data meshes. OK, so we saved uh, the best for last. So stay tuned. This is super, super exciting. So we've been talking about data and AI, and every company is going to be a data and AI company. Uh, I'm super excited to welcome to stage Wasim from Rivian. These are really cool vehicles. You might have seen them on the streets. These are elect electric adventure vehicles, and they leverage lake house and the building AI and generative AI into all of it. So let's welcome into stage. Thanks, Ali. Hi, everyone. Super excited. Great crowd today. Automotive is going through a fascinating transformation. Technologies such as autonomy, connectivity, electrification are driving more and more software content. With software-defined vehicles and an amazing hardware platform, you don't need to have one vehicle for your daily commute, another vehicle for as an off-road adventure, and then a third vehicle to have fun over the weekend as a sports car. You can have all in one with just one click of a button. Let's see that in action. I love this truck. By the way, I have the same exact configuration. The only issue is my wife doesn't want to give it back to me, so I have to drive the SUV. So you have seen software uh, with software-defined vehicles is really important. What's even more important is the software that runs outside the vehicle. Deep over-the-air update technologies allow us to update every single computer in the vehicle and make the vehicle better and better over time. Analytics and telematics help us get detailed insights into the health of the vehicle. Everything at Rivian is data-driven, not just our product, our technology, but also our supply chain, our manufacturing, our customer relationship, our service experience. With all this excitement around data and as a company born in the cloud, we faced multiple challenges as we scaled our execution. Sounds familiar, right? Data density volume was too high. We had more than five different systems, which ended up creating silos and impacted overall collaboration. Multiple data types, multiple tools led to duplicative and reliable data and downstream applications. Only a niche team of experts could manage all data analytics for the entire company and very quickly became a bottleneck. Security and privacy are very important tenants for our company, our brand. But ensuring governance with such complex architecture was extremely challenging. This is where Databricks came into the picture. The clear solution for these technical challenges was to pivot towards a lake house powered by Databricks. We built a new architecture on top of Delta Lake, solving for data quality at petabytes scale. Unity Catalog enables us to provide security and access at scale to more than 1,100 users. 
actually, I heard last night that we're the second highest user of Unity Catalog among all Databricks customers. <laughs> this unified data platform architecture supports a diverse set of needs, from data warehousing and data analytics to machine learning and data science, all on a single source of truth. This enables us to ultimately achieve our goal of data democratization, as Ali uh, mentioned today, as a common theme for the different presentations, while combining scale and agility. Now, let us talk of how this data and AI platform helps us achieve and unlock business outcomes for our customers. When we think about AI for electric vehicles, everybody thinks about autonomy. But there's much more that AI can do to improve the experience. In electric vehicles, one of the most important and actually the most expensive component is the battery pack. Improving the usage of this system, its health over time, and its performance is extremely important for the overall EV experience. Our lake house architecture powers data and insights across charging, monitoring, fleet, and service. As a driver, my Rivian charges faster, less time charging, more time exploring the adventure. For battery health, our machine learning models leverage on thousands of lab test points, field data, manufacturing data to get the best performance of our battery pack. As a driver, software can unlock more range, and software can make my battery optimized to last longer. Another area where data and AI is helping us completely reshape the experience is service. In the traditional automotive model, you wait until an issue happens or a maintenance is scheduled. You bring your vehicle to the dealership, and you get your vehicle physically inspected. I am sure all of you have memories of long waiting hours at the dealership to understand what's going on. Rivian seeks to change that with data and AI. Rivian vehicles are equipped with prognostic sensors with the sole purpose of providing mechanical diagnostic data. These mechanical data, along with the existing software and electrical data, help us get a rich platform where we can apply analytical modeling and machine learnings, not just to detect if an issue happened, but, but also to predict when future reliability issues may happen. This is a building foundation for our North Star. Imagine a world where your vehicle will self-monitor its health. An AI agent in your vehicle will detect when a future problem might happen your vehicle will automatically schedule its own service. We send you one of our mobile vans. I mean, look at these beautiful vans. And we give you back your most precious resource, your time. None of these use cases would have been possible without this unified data platform architecture. Data break, lake house, provided us the scale, the security, and the centralized governance so that we can deliver on such amazing end-to-end -end experiences. We are super excited about our collaboration with Databricks. Many more exciting things are happening at Rivian. Look at our, go and check our career website. Uh, go also check the awesome truck in the expo hall. Thank you. <laughs>